So anti the menace is back in jail a week after bond after Rollo bonded him out. So we just gonna get straight into it before I give y'all my thoughts on it. Oh, when you wake up, daddy, you are the bitch call your name. I know the feeling, bitch. <laughs> you can't trick me. <laughs> Baby gonna do what I tell her. We gonna survive it together. Yeah. We ain't doing it for black and yellow. No. We gonna do this cause we back together. Yeah. I ain't giving up. I ain't going broke. Thumbing through this shit into my throat. Hold up, man. I got this. I'm saying house shoes on, but you know, damn. Shit on the floor, man, bro. Put up You're watching t Talk on the Media. It's saying dog all on the floor. Blue cheese. You find a, you find a twin or anything in here, I'm a pussy, nigga. What the fuck you talking about? Got Uncle here with me, I am. Yeah, boy. Okay. My grandma. We back, bitch. Free the fucking foster, nigga. My mama. Free the fuck. Yeah. I can't believe Lil Anti locked back up, man. You got way too much talent. We need you out here making millions so we can take care of the family. We went through hell to get you out that motherfucker. I know the internet finna bash me and keep saying, Rollo, I told you he was gonna be back in jail, but I don't give a fuck. I'm gonna spend whatever, whenever any of my mans get a bond because I will want them to do the same for me. I told the label to take down the video I dropped today. I'm finna put a budget up for you. I'm dropping our sh next Friday. I love you forever. Um... So Lil Anti, Lil Anti the Menace or Anti the Menace is back in jail for violation of his curfew. Y'all know Rollo bonded him out on a hundred and thirty thousand dollar bond. Came home, wasn't home pretty long, as you can see. We making the video. He was supposed to be in the house by eight o'clock. Just keep it all the way a thousand. But y'all know, man, niggas got to get some pussy, man. Niggas got to get back in the mix, man. Niggas got to, they home, they fresh home. That's all they know to do is be in the mix. It's hard being, you know. And if he ain't, he just kind of messed up because he was on the bracelet, man. So it's kind of like you got that reminder to look down and be like, hey, bro, I got to be home. Rollo said he bonded him out again. Shout out Rollo though, man. Cause Rollo, Rollo obviously believe in him enough to know, bro, y'all niggas gonna fuck up. But damn, $130,000 bond. I wish I had people to put up on a quick little $130,000 for me. Shit, will give me a quick $130,000 right now. So this is what we talk about. When we say Atlanta niggas stick together. Now this some stick together type of shit, Rollo. This is a good definition of Atlanta niggas sticking together. Lil Anti, he just young. Lil, or Anti the Menace. They young, bro. They gonna fuck up. <laughs> but with a promising career and a promising future, it's like, bro. Let me go ahead and knock this shit out the way, bro. I don't even want problems. I don't know. I'm thinking how I always thought. Bro, I don't even want no problems with them people. If I have problems with the people, I right, we gonna deal with it and get out of the way. Some of these young niggas just be crash out. Some of these young niggas like like I guess the lifestyle that come with it. I thought the goal is always to make it out the streets. So if you get many chances to make it out the streets, why not leave the streets? But then I, I understanding the mindset 
of a, a street nigga. Guess you gotta be a full blown street nigga to understand it. Who am I? Rollo getting um anti the minutes back out of jail. Now he dropped the first day out. I guess he got to drop another first day out. But the first first day out, he was dissing Baby Kid and another rapper. Let's see how it all play out. Free anti the minutes. Rollo a solid one. Mm -hmm. 